Fix the World Organization updates for 2019. Hello and Happy New Year. We here at the Fix the World Organization wanted to take this opportunity to update everyone on some of our plans for 2019. In this update, we will be discussing our new websites, our growing projects, changes to our reporting policies on the QEG, and our plans for the future. We here at the Fix the World organization are a family of four running several different projects on two different continents in the United States and Morocco. In 2018, we successfully completed one full year of bi-weekly live calls at our Clean Energy Academy. With a total of 27 live calls so far, we have grown an archive of engineering information that includes special guest speakers, clean energy presentations, and QEG build updates. The Academy has maintained a solid base of members that has allowed us to pay for the platform elements needed to host engineering and media information in a secure and protected environment. We plan on increasing our effort in 2019 in hopes to double our membership and offer even more open source DIY engineering information now that we have established a strong foundation. You can check out the Clean Energy Academy and the Live Calls archive at the link below. Fix the World Orgone is well into its second year and growing. We've personally handmade and shipped out our Organite to well over 1,000 happy customers in countries all over the world. We've introduced a few new products, which will include a Shungite Organite phone shield, which is coming soon. And also we've got several new information videos coming out talking about the different uses of Organite and how you can use it to help protect yourself from EMFs that come from Wi-Fi, 5G, and cell phones. Many of our customers are loving the results that they're experiencing from our products. They come back to purchase more, and we love making them knowing that we're helping people. Check out our Organite shop here at the link below. Also be sure to check out the many videos that we've put on our new FTW Orgone YouTube channel. We have launched a new website for the sale of our affiliate clean energy products called Fringe Energy. The best way to describe our new website is through a review of one of our customers and supporters, who says, if you're interested in new advanced clean energy science and technology, here is the place to be. Fringe Energy is the most comprehensive online source for access to this type of information. I know the good people behind Fringe Energy and can testify to their sincerity, expert knowledge, and commitment. They are among the most trusted people involved in this field and are connected to the other leaders in this kind of science and technology around the globe. From Ed Becknell. You can visit the new site here at FringeEnergy.com. Also visit the new Fringe Energy shop where you'll find information on the QEG, the audio course, the ebook, the manual, beginner's webinars, advanced webinars, Organite DVDs, forbidden tech, audiobook, 10 module video course, and energy science and technology conference videos. Be sure to check out our many affiliate energy products also found on the Fringe Energy website coming from eMedia Press. Products about open system thermodynamics, perpetual motion reality, battery secrets and battery rejuvenation combos, battery secrets, magnet secrets, Bedini Schoolgirl Beyond the Advanced Handbook, Bedini Schoolgirl The Complete Handbook Series Trilogy, Tesla's Radiant Energy Videos and PDF Combo Pack, and much, much more. At Fix the World, we also have quite the to-do list for 2019. We are working diligently on updating our websites and creating more content around the topics we wrote about in our book, Forbidden Tech, which is now available for sale on Amazon. Click on the link below so you can purchase your printed copy of our book, Forbidden Tech, on Amazon today. Changes in our reporting policy. We are sad to say that we can no longer report on any technical aspects of the QEG project in a free and open public manner. For example, writing blog posts or making videos for YouTube that show the latest technical updates around the project, including any breakthrough announcements and any questions asked of us in a public manner about the technical or business specifications of the project. The reasons for this are due to the relentless onslaught of harassment and trolling on our family, our business, and this project. Any and all public information we have released about the QEG is immediately duplicated and tampered with in an effort to discredit us and the project. Please note that the trolling has been severe and includes large quantities of trolling videos and online content along with stalking, harassment, vulgarity, and death threats. 
There is more, much, much more that we have experienced that we will have to save for another post in the future. We have taken screenshots of everything over the last three or four years and are producing a report disclosing all of the evidence that we hope to have published in the coming months. While we wish we could be open and friendly with everyone we meet, we have learned, unfortunately, that this is not always possible given the current hostile environment that abounds on social media and covert surveillance and trolling programs. We now limit who we speak to. We prefer not to use Facebook Messenger or Skype. We request that we be contacted by email and not through anonymous and unsecured messaging systems. We monitor all YouTube comments. All of our business or product information is carefully managed and stored in a secure environment that we pay for. We do not answer inappropriate or invasive questions about our business to strangers without legal credentials. We have an accountant and lawyers that handle those affairs. I shouldn't even have to say this, but you would be amazed at what kind of crazy things anonymous people on the internet will throw at you. These are the reasons why we do not feel that it is safe to make any public announcements or reports on the technical progress of the QEG project. All of our reporting is done through our live calls, which are open to Academy members and also to non-members who pay a $5 fee per call. All technical schematics, reports, and other forms of printed data are stored on our secure website and only available to members. There have been many fraudulent copies of old and outdated project information circulated around in an attempt to confuse the public. We have no control over this, but we can only say that unless you receive the latest project updates around the QEG from us at the Academy, any other documentation, including old documentation from 2014, is probably not valid. Sharing information on our secure members platform is what is necessary to protect our family and the integrity of this project. We thank you for understanding this. In the meantime, we have been creating explanatory videos around the QEG project for YouTube to try to document the reasons why we no longer report technical information. You can check out those videos on our new YouTube channel here, Hope Girl and the QEG. Our commitment to this work, regardless of the hard road that it has been so far and the many lessons we've learned along the way, we still feel that it is our life's assignment and mission to carry this project through to completion. Regardless of challenges in funding, or opposition, or delays beyond our control, we will continue to press on with the work for as long as we have the capacity to do so. So far, 2019 looks very promising, and we look forward to steady growth and increasing stability in our organization. All the best to you from Naima, Tavon, James, and Valerie of the Fix the World organization and the Clean Energy Academy.